You're right, but while we're talking about this, something just popped into my head that I want to make a statement. This is a public statement. Please, I hope this goes as viral as possible. Since I became the most famous man in the world, and quickly, I, I want everyone to know that I'm not stating that as hyperbole. I am currently the most famous man on the planet because I've broken the matrix because I am Morpheus. I said earlier on in this emergency meeting that, James, can you find out if I'm more famous, the most famous man in the world, blah, blah, blah. Here we go. This is search terms against Jake Paul, which we're going to talk about because me and him, I told him I was going to fight him. I actually, I, I like the Paul brothers. I'm going to interject. So make your point and I'm going to tell you why I like them. Well, I'm more famous than him. Okay. okay I'm fine. the blue line. He's the red line. Yeah, this fine. is Google searches. Yeah, right. This now. is me against Joe Biden. <laughs> I'm, I'm higher. I, I can't make it fit even though I'm number one producer. Maybe I can make it fit like this. Higher than Joe Biden. One second, one second, one second. No, it doesn't fit either. Mr. Producer. Okay, whatever. Okay. I'm higher than Joe Biden. You're, you're currently the most talked about famous man in the world. I'm higher yes. than Donald Trump. I'm top G. Yeah, top G. I'm the most talked about man in the world. Now, Joe you're, Biden, you think you're president. I'm top G. <laughs> you're not top G, Joe Biden. You're not top G. I am. He couldn't spell top G. Right. Can I, right. Now, now that you've mentioned them, let me talk about why I like the Paul brothers. I, and I genuinely do like something that they've done. And it, it is really credible to, to their character. Most of these people who grow up, as I said, being internet content creators and make money, they grow up being clowns. We made money and then we decided to create some content on the internet. These guys have won at least had the balls to get in the ring. Massive respect, because anyone who gets in the ring, it's a dangerous sport, and uh, you know it, it, it's real shit. And anyone who says that his fights are rigged, I don't think his fights are rigged at all. He carefully picks his opponents, but his fights aren't rigged. But he has bought back something that I really like. I really like that back in the day, in, in, in 17th century Europe, if you had beef with a man, and everyone knew that you publicly disagreed, you could say, ha ha, I challenge you to a duel. I challenge you, let's have it out in public and settle our affairs. I think it was Logan who bought this back with KSI. Shout out to KSI as well. I saw his video on us. That's pretty cool. Um, they bought back this old, uh, you have beef with me. Okay, let's settle it with fisticuffs. Let's s settle it like men. So if, fact, a straightener. If, if it wasn't for the Paul brothers, th there would still be mindless internet beef going on and you couldn't say, let's have a fight. Let's actually sort this out. So I genuinely massively respect the Paul brothers for that. They bought that back and it, it's a, it's a, it's a custom as old as time. And it's been back five years. And I'd say they are largely at credit and at fault for bringing that back. So uh, hats off to them. Uh, nothing but respect from, from my end. Yeah. I made a video calling out Jake Paul. I, I, if I, if me and Jake Paul fight, I will destroy him because I am a professional and he knows I'll destroy him and that's fine. But that aside, when I first made that video is when he was calling out Conor McGregor and I thought he was just being disrespectful and he was just a clown. It turns out he's taking his boxing career quite seriously. He's, he's getting, really training. He's training. He's getting in the ring when he doesn't have to get in the ring. You know, he has enough money. He doesn't have to do this. Yes. He's putting it on the line. He's putting his reputation on the line. I know that takes balls. I respect him for it. So I understand now that he's very serious about his boxing career. And you're right. They brought back the old school. Have you got beef? Let's fight. I love that they brought that, that back. I love that they brought this back because I'll fight Ethan any day of the week. I'll fight anyone. <laughs> yeah. That's who I am. Anyone right? who has beef. Anyone who has beef. If, if, if Jake wants to fucking fight me, I'll fight him. I ain't scared of nobody on this fucking planet. I'll fight anybody. But I do like that they brought that back. You're right. That's Thank a really you. good point. Thank you. Now. Because we talked about this. Because I want to talk about something else. Well, now that I'm the most famous man in the world, as we just proved I'm the most famous man in the world. 